you for joining us, ladies and gentlemen. We've got the usual full house, and we are ready to get this party started. We are coming to you live, eager to hear that opening bell. Don't touch that TV remote, because the lineup we've got on tap is one for the ages. And what a lineup on this card, starting with a bang tag team match. Up next is the long awaited championship match. Everybody's been waiting for this one. It'll be the Hollywood Blondes versus the Queens. It's finally going to happen. These two top teams are going to collide. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, and it is for the championship. Introducing the challengers, Carmella and Alexa Bliss, the Hollywood Blondes. Carmella making her way to the ring. Personally, I don't like the challengers' chances here. The champ has been looking very dominant of late. And introducing the champions, they are the Natalia Women's Tag Team and Trish. This is amazing. A third generation diva is approaching the ring. This will be good. No kidding. Natalia definitely has the pedigree. Now we'll see if she has what it takes to take this match here tonight. Thank you for spending part of your evening with us. We think you're really going to enjoy this upcoming match. So much anticipation, and it all comes down to this. Thank you for choosing to spend your evening with us. I'm Michael Cole, alongside, as always, Jerry the King Lawler. And I can't think of another place I'd rather be, Michael. This one should be amazing, Michael. is under a great deal of stress right now.
Carmella has to be thinking about what right now. In a tag team. And she gets the shoulders up. Yeah, I don't know how, but she did. Looking to get on a roll here. And there's the face buster. Don't look in the mirror after that one. Hey, I heard when you look in the mirror, your reflection throws up. Yeah. If she takes more punishment like that, I'm not sure if her arm is going to be able to move at all. She's got her sights set on her opponent's chest. If that neck is seriously injured, the rep may want to step in here. The challenger's taking on some offense, but you can bet she won't let this golden opportunity slip away now. This one's far from over, Michael. Don't count her out yet. Well, I can't argue that point, John, and neither one of these women has really taken control of this match. He's starting to get on a roll. Oh, this could be exciting.
What does Alexa Bliss need to do now? But can she turn things around and defeat the champion here tonight? Well, she's certainly not in a great spot, but I'm not prepared to declare her the loser just yet. You know, she's going to need to show a bit more respect if she expects anybody from this crowd to show concern for the punishment she's taken so far tonight. Whoops. Trish Stratus is just so dangerous. This match has swayed her way very quickly here. I love it when things sway her way. at complete domination here. Trish Stratus. Showing us how to get it done. Big time. Oh, jeez. Knocked in the next week. Alexa Bliss showing her skills. And she pulls a new trick from her bag with that one. Showboating going on here. Oh, the reversal by Trish Stratus. The champs absorbing some offense. Here, but she has the fight of a champion in her. which will certainly help her down the stretch. Well, I don't know if these Divas could be any more evenly matched than they are. What a match. I don't disagree. And also, I wouldn't be too concerned right now if I was her. There's still plenty of match to go. By the looks of things, this match is all but over. Oh, Alexa Bliss is taking a beating. She could be out at any moment now. Well, she doesn't look good, that's for sure. But I'm not ready to write her off just yet. Well said. Look at the attack here. Oh, man. Talk about a direct hit. This match has taken so much out of her. She had that move in her repertoire. 
She's going to need to dig down deep if she wants to keep going now. From what we've seen in her tonight, it must be serious injuries. No kidding. This is going to need some serious medical attention. Natalia is a force within the ring. And we're seeing a vicious attack to the pad. And now it is show-off time. Don't waste time floating here. Natalia now in a little bit of trouble. Her and her partner aren't going to let this derail them, though. The bottom line is she's winning. It may not be pretty, but she's definitely been the more dominant force up to this point. Okay, I'll agree. She is looking a little off her game, but hey, it's nothing she can't overcome. here. Okay, now she's just showing off. And it's Alexa Bliss with the reversal. Alexa Bliss is not someone to sleep on. I think she's trying to prove a point here. What a counter that was. Nice reversal. This match has taken so much out of her. Natalia and Trish Stratus. 
the Queens. You want to talk about a tag team war? We most definitely witnessed just that. This was from bell to bell, a clinic in tag team wrestling. Kudos to everyone. I love tag team matches, and that was one of the best I've seen in a while. And that is why this team has those championship titles around their waist. Believe it or not, that's just the beginning, folks. Stay tuned for more great action. We have been waiting a long time for this. The championship is up for grabs right here next. It'll be Randy Orton in a match against five of WWE's finest. Well, your guess is as good as mine as who's going to win this matchup. The following contest is a battle royal, and it is for the championship. Introducing the challenger from St. Louis, Missouri, weighing in at 250 pounds, the Viper, Randy Orton. Well, this guy looks eager to add some gold around his waist. Let's see if he can do it. You have to wonder if the challenger has what it takes to topple what has been a very dominant champion. And introducing the challenger, representing American Alpha from Minneapolis, Minnesota, weighing in at 200 pounds, Chad Gable. We're moments from writing another page in the WWE history books with this six-man matchup. Are you serious, Cole? You think this could be historic? A win here would do wonders for this guy's career. And introducing the challenger, representing the NWO from Detroit, Michigan, weighing in at 328 pounds, Kevin Nash. Can you imagine what a win here would do for our challenger's career? Those eyes tell the story of somebody hell-bent on picking up the win here tonight.
to show us what that reason is. He looks geared up and ready to go tonight. Introducing the challenger, representing the core, from Melbourne, Australia, weighing in at 227 pounds, Buddy Murphy. Murphy walking to the ring with a purpose here tonight, King. Yeah, this should be interesting. Well, you can tell by the walk. The challenger is ready for this one. assure you confidence alone will not dethrone the champion very curious to see how well these teams coexist in this six-man tag team match And thank you for being part of what promises to be an amazing night. I'm Michael Cole, joined as always by the King himself.
He's a Hall of Famer, Jerry the King Lawler. Well, enough about me, Michael. Let's talk about you. What do you think of me? This one's going to be great. <laughs> this guy can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with anybody. Oh, I think this man needs business as the action progresses. Let's briefly talk about the challenger. He has actually no problem getting noticed. He's among the most bold superstars there are. When you're not used to relying on two others, these type of matches can be tough to adjust to. I'll be interested to see how this one plays out. Well, one thing's for certain. You're never going to overlook him. I mean, not with that type of personality. Not going to win many matches with that move. suplex see what kind of response we'll get yeah i'm telling you that suplex was perfect you know if the wwe fans know one thing it's that randy orton is one of the most elite and there's an elimination oh that's gonna hurt come on now he just wants that insult to injury yeah this guy's a mean streak Moves like that can upset your opponent more than hurt them. Mr. McMahon is a force within the ring. Look at Chad Gable here. I believe that is the first time tonight we've seen that move. Undertaker's not playing around. Got out of the way of that one. And Chad Gable is able to get out of the way. His Uncle Clark would be proud. Unleashing it for the second time now. He's making a statement here with this attack. How does Kevin Nash come back from this brutal onslaught? And you have to wonder how much the challenger can sustain at this point. Wow, these guys aren't giving an inch, but at some point, one of them got to start pulling away, which is what we might be seeing right now. Well, if he's going to do it, now might be the time to whip out something bold, Cole.
Murphy can turn it up anytime he wants. Yeah. And this match is over for that superstar. The champ just one step quicker. Oh, good night. A fever pitch is here in the WWE Universe. You're right about that. The crowd is buzzing. They're ready for this thing to get underway. And The Undertaker managed to reverse out of that one. Few superstars are as... Dominant as this guy. He's certainly showing There's something new from his repertoire. That's cool. I like new stuff. Nice reversal there. He's endured heavy blows here. I don't know how much longer he can go. The referee may have to call this match, King. Oh, my gosh, this is awful. I'm going to tell you something. Whenever you get hit like that, for the next 15 minutes, everybody you see has an exact win. Oh, he missed. Oh, -ho, nobody home that time. new champion and will things in the wwe ever be the same again you're right i think the entire landscape of the wwe just changed and on top of that there's a new champion in the buckle up because we have a contest that's going to blow the roof off this place don't buckle up the hell with it it's New Age Outlaws versus the Lucha Dragons. I got to say, guys, I like the looks of both of these teams. Oh, you didn't know? Go ask for the call! 
somebody. Hits me, hits me, hits that D O double G. Rolling once again with that B A double D. Cut the music. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, D Generation X proudly brings to you its WWE Tag Team Champion of the World. The Road Dog, Jesse James, the Badass, Billy Gunn, the New Age Outlaw! And of course, if you're not down with that, we got two words for you! And their opponents, at a combined weight of 375 pounds, Kalisto and Seed Gana, the Lucha Dragons. Here comes Kalisto. He'll be flying in here. You'd be hard-pressed to find a better tag team match than we're about to see here. Welcome to another unforgettable night of WWE action. I'm Michael Cole, alongside my broadcast partner, WWE Hall of Famer, Jerry the King Lawler. And Michael, I can barely hear myself think. Would you listen to this crowd? Man, talk about an insatiable appetite for action. This is absolutely fantastic. Well, well, well. That's the first time tonight we've seen that move. I wouldn't mind seeing it a little more often. Let's talk about Kalisto for a moment. What does he need to do to make sure his team comes out on top here? This Kalisto's fun to watch, Michael. He bounces around that ring like a pinball. Don't tag out, kid. I'm having too much fun watching you. Man, what a team. You know, I really consider this duo to be one of the top in WWE today. Kalisto's innovative offense is unlike anything I've seen in years. Yeah, and not only is he executing moves that have never even been seen or dreamt of, but he does it with lightning quick speed. to do at this point to stay in the match his hopes of winning this tag team match are starting to dwindle i completely agree and if i'm him right now i'm starting to get a little concerned well he can't be meek meek yeah meek if he wants to come out on top in this one we're gonna need to see some of that aggression that he's become known for match. Well, he's not looking as good as he was earlier, but that doesn't mean he's done. Yeah, you know, I'm thinking it might be a good time for him to switch up his game plan. Whatever he's been doing just isn't working right now. Oh my God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. And I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. 
damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. And that one hit with the force of a big rig. He needs to dig way down deep if he wants to keep going now. Ronnie missed that one. God, that's got to hurt. Yeah. We're not doing any damage with swings like that, but keep doing it. The freeze may give him a cold. Look out. Seen Carl is measuring. Oh, that can't feel good. He's talking his opponent from the top turnbuckle. Yeah, I wonder what the view's like from up there. Uh-oh. Where else but in the WWE are you going to see something like that? He anticipated that move perfectly. He gets out of trouble there. He was one step ahead on that one. That may be the first time we've seen that executed. Uh, going to the top. High risk. Nice move. And a dangerous move. Watch it. To take a chance like that. Do you know how badly he must want to win this? Kalisto is tagged in. We talked a bit about Kalisto's speed, but his agility, I'd say, is equally amazing, particularly when he takes to the air and starts contorting his body in ways never thought imaginable. Does this guy remind you of me or what? <laughs> sleep on nobody home there nobody home Cole, that looked like the house has been empty for months rolling out of harm's way smart strategy there i don't remember the last time he executed that maneuver he's in full-on attack mode now and you wouldn't be any more right about kalisto's mid-air agility Cole. I guess that's why they call him the king of flight. Get it? King. Look at this. Kalisto showing signs of slowing down. This tag team match can get out of hand quickly if he doesn't mount an offense soon. I don't disagree, Michael. At this point, though, the story has to be the two finishers that failed to put his opponent away. And did you see the look on his face when that second finisher didn't put him away? I don't think he expected that. He took too much time, and boy, did he pay the price. Long-term injuries for sure. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Kalisto. Interesting move here, taking the match to the outside. Interesting and dangerous. What a forceful attack to the back region. guy is a hell of a competitor. I mean, he goes out there and leaves it all in the ring every single night. Uh-oh. Oh, he's got some company. And see, to me, this is absolute disrespect. Look at these guys just mocking him. They're just coming out here to get a little better look. Hold on to your seats. We have singles action coming up next. I'm looking forward to it. It'll be Samoa Joe against Roman Reigns. The anticipation for this match is off the charts.
and ready for this match tonight, awaiting his opponent. And I'm not sure that two types in this business, those that can handle pain and losers. This next match might be every bit as good as the last one. We got one-on-one -on -one action coming your way next, King. It's the best. It'll be Samoa Joe against Roman Reigns. <laughs> oh, man. I can't wait to see these two go at it. And ready for this match tonight, awaiting his opponent. Two types in this business, those that can handle pain and losers. And his opponent from Stone Mountain, Georgia, weighing in at 249 pounds, Jake the Snake. Oh, this match is going to be exciting. I can almost guarantee it. This guy's a stud. I don't see many losses in his future. Oh, yeah. Here we go. My God, the back rake has got to hurt. Oh, I used to hate a back rake. of offense here. As the action continues, let's discuss Samoa Joe briefly. I can't think of too many superstars that the WWE Universe loves to hate more than this guy. Hey, he's a WWE superstar, which means he's among the very best to lace up pair of boots. But does he have what it takes to beat his competition here tonight? That remains to be seen. Yeah, and I've got a feeling these two superstars both brought their A-games tonight. Samoa Joe looking a little startled right now. He's still got plenty of gas left in his tank, though. Michael, we're going to see what this guy is made of. And on top of that, John, these two guys couldn't be any more evenly matched at this point. He's certainly showing us something new from his repertoire. That's cool. I like new stuff. It looked like his whole neck just crumbled there. Maneuvers like that put everybody in danger. No kidding, that's awful. He wants no part of the outside. And I don't blame him. Nothing good ever happens outside the ring. Whoa, take a look at that. We haven't seen that one tonight. I love something new. Jake Roberts not where he wants to be right now. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. And Michael, this might very well be where one of these guys pulls away from the other. Oh, it's been a great matchup to this point. And this could really go either way. A uh, quick pin. He's got plenty of gas left in his. You're right, he kicked out with ease. Oh, check that out. We have a first here this evening. And that was awesome. Somehow, he's kicking into another gear here tonight. Let's just hope Samoa Joe's stamina can hold up. Great counter.
is nice. One more time. He doesn't want to win this one outside the ring. Because he's a pro king, he wants to get it done inside. The more punishment he takes, the slower and slower he is getting back to his feet. I'm having a hard time figuring out what they're going to do next. Me too. I've given up even trying to figure out what they're going to do. Watch out! This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Man, oh man, did he take a wild swing with that one. You're right. That was wild indeed. Good thing we're over here. Oh, the snake with a big reverse. And that one hurt his hand. Samoa Joe with his back against the wall. And at this point, you have to wonder if he can recover from this. Roberts looking to strike here. They can end it here. What now? I'm a bit surprised that we saw a pin attempt here, King. I don't think he's done nearly enough to get the one, two, three. Oh, I absolutely agree. I don't know where he's finding the strength to stay in this one. My God, his body's been through hell, and his ribs have bore the brunt of the attack. Man, I hope we can get a doctor out here as a precaution. Damaged ribs like that can make it hard to breathe. We got a cover. And the shoulder's up now. That's a kick out. Nice. There's no keeping this guy down tonight. Nicely done. Take the snake, Roberts. Put it in on him right now. An elbow. Nowhere to go for the snake. There's a good chance he can't recover from this. Hold on. You have to think one of these times he goes for his finisher, it'll actually finish this thing, right? Oh, man. At this point, he's just risking serious injury. I mean, take it from... Me, one match is just not worth your career. Oh, the snake with a big reversal. He may get the three count right there. Gonna be this one's not over yet. Not over yet, but how much longer can it go? Wow, what a display of heart and determination. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Reversal. Snake! Well, this might be the worst yet. Oh boy. He's got his opponent up on that top rope. No, no, no!
Could this be it? I think so. Two. And Samoa Joe picks up the win. Big time win. Here's your winner, Samoa Joe! Uh oh, oh, you said it! Uh oh, this isn't going to end well. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. Look at this! He's just barely moving! I'm not sure he can get back to his feet. Look at this, Cole. This is a move I invented. The Tamara Platts. Yes. I love that, though. This is nice. One more time. Whoa. Don't get up. Samoa. Joe has the right idea. Get in his head. Look at Samoa Joe, Cole. He's making his move. Yeah, trying to pick up a win here. Uh, that's Samoa Joe specialty. And he's got Oh, he's going to have to block out the pain if he hopes to escape this. We got one-on-one -on -one action coming your way next. Going to be good. It's Shane McMahon versus Undertaker. <laughs> oh, man. I can't wait to see these two go at it. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring, representing the corporation from Greenwich, Connecticut. Weighing in at 236 pounds, Shane McMahon. Oh boy, we're in for a treat tonight. Both of these superstars look geared up and ready to go. Man, I can't wait to see these two square off in one-on-one -on -one action.
and we're underway. Looking at these two men, I don't think there's going to be anything traditional about this one-on-one -on -one matchup. Don't be surprised at all if these guys attempt to one-up each other in this one. Two superstars going head-to-head. -head. I love it. But hey, anytime somebody with the last name McMahon steps into the ring, things automatically get more interesting in the WWE. And that's why the adage holds true. There's a first time for everything. I think you're right. I believe that's the first time he's ever attempted this. You've seen this man compete many times, King. What are your thoughts on Shane? It seems as though his popularity grows with each passing week. We're going to find out a lot here tonight. Head to head, no excuses. Let's get it on. Yeah, you know, you can't over-science these things. It's a man's game and all they want is... Escapes the hole. His nose might end up where his ear is by the time this one's over. Delivered a beautiful uppercut, man. That had some force behind it. Some force. That was devastating. Perhaps they're going to take the action to the outside here. Perhaps. It's happening, Cole, right before your very eyes. Shane McMahon turns it around. With a 180, The Undertaker, the reversal. That's a first. What a move. Definitely sets a tone for the evening. I like it. Oh, nobody home. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. You've been here before. Oh, I certainly have. The Undertaker with a great offensive show. John, you know what this is all about? It's a long way down. I still cringe. We got a cover. One, two. Oh, he's not done fighting yet. Just when you thought it was over. Wow. For a move like that, he's going to need to see a chiropractor or a spine specialist, whatever he's comfortable with. No pun intended, of course. Yeah, he's not going to be comfortable for a while. Undertaker looking mortal here. He's going to want to make sure this doesn't snowball out of control. Come on, you and I both know that a little adversity isn't going to end this guy's night. In fact, it might make him stronger. Come on. How many times is this guy going to use his finisher? It might be time to audible that game plan a bit. It seems the focus of his onslaught is directly on the back. This is going to be brutal. Yeah, that back is in bad shape. Undertaker with a reversal. Well, it looks like I'm not the only one who didn't see that one coming. This match has taken so much out of this guy, he's not going to give up. But man, this has been physical. Can he end it quickly? If the referee counts. One. And a kick out. Much to nobody's. Surprise. Right, this guy's resilient. He's not even beat down yet. That move should do it. I mean, this should have been over a while ago. Come on, Raph. Yeah, this should be over. He's delivering an old-fashioned butt-kicking right here. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. Well, I've never seen him do that before. And there's the face buster! Looks like he's shutting down the carotid arteries here. And he rolls out, buying himself some breathing room. Looks like he's pinpointing the back. This is where Shane McMahon just shines. Using that man family intellect and instinctual knowledge of the human condition to manipulate someone. 
Wow, can't believe The Undertaker got out of that one. He's certainly showing us something new from his repertoire. That's cool. I like new stuff. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. You've been here before. Oh, I certainly have. see him giving up. Whoa! Shane McMahon and in the kick out. He'll be feeling the effects of that for a while. Oh, look at the emotion. He's not exactly popping up to his feet here. Well, what do you expect, Michael? Did you see what just happened? Honey missed that one. God, that's got to hurt. Yeah. We're not doing any damage with swings like that, but keep doing it. The breeze may give him a cold. This is a wreck. He's moving like an uncaged animal. No lie. He's wild in there. wins that'll build momentum as you head into your championship match. And there's the champion. Champion coming down to get a little closer look. He has to be impressed with the number one contender tonight. You're right, he has to be. Right now, 